Et bien salut tout le monde, c'est Xebune, aujourd'hui on se retrouve donc pour, pour, pour l'épisode 2 de notre euh, série sur The Walking Dead. Je crois que ça va être bien. Parce que l'épisode 1 était très bien. L'épisode 2. Bon, on va partir direct. Le 2 était très choquant. Hein. Moi j'étais choqué dans la fin. Donc on va partir tout de suite, euh, je crois que je récorde juste après. Voilà. Je, bon, j'attends une petite demi-heure le temps de me calmer parce que bon, j'étais un peu choqué. Mais je sais pas. These are dark days, I fear. The North Grove must never be lost. You're sending him to the war. The boy's done nothing wrong. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. I've decided to name you as my sentinel servant. I'm just worried about my family. The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. Are you willing to risk an alliance with the crown? It's a risk I'm willing to take, Lord Tyrion. Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Rasher. We don't want White Hill men within these walls. You can be my highborn ward. Oh. Ethan. Oh. No. Don't let them take oh. me. Oh. C'est terrible hein. Whoa, it's just me, Beska. Took you long enough. The rail's getting warm. Or warmer, I should say. Ah. Bon, bah, bon, je suis sur le This stuff is weak compared to Northern Ale. You can stop pacing. They'll be here soon. Is that wine? Or blood? Taste it and find out. It's blood. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this place could use a good cleaning. I complain to the owner, except he's probably dead. Looks like we weren't the first to rough up the place. Nice having the place to ourselves, though. Fragrant. Ale. Goes in yellow, comes out yellow. Waste time even drinking it, if you ask me. Considering we found it in an abandoned tavern, it's not bad. They smell off to you. It's the only thing in Yunkai that doesn't. I know. It's a filthy haven for thieves, murderers, and other deadly bastards. You should feel right at home. I know I do. May we drink, thieve, and fight until the end. You know, I'm not really a bastard. But you're my kind of bastard. It's half the reason we're friends. Another round? Have you forgotten about our honored and exalted guest? Go see if he's still breathing. <laughs> no 
is he doing? We need him alive to collect his bounty. After that... He looks fine. Fat and scared. Good. Let him stay that way. Until we collect our gold, at least. 800 gold dragons for capturing him. Lucky we caught him trying to flee Yunkai. Lucky for us. Not so lucky for him. We should find more former slave masters with bounties on their heads. I don't need any more naked fat men in my life, thank you. <laughs> they say only the poor know how to really spend money. We'll buy the finest wines, the best whores. Sleep in a bed without fleas? Sounds nice, doesn't it? We've not been paid yet, Beska. Can't spend dragons you don't have. We'll have them soon enough. My point is, with enough coin, we could do anything. Go anywhere. I could afford passage back to Westeros. To Ironrath. I've heard nothing from my family in years. You mean go home? They treated you like shit there. Kicked you out because you fell in love with a girl from the wrong damn house. Gwyn. A man doesn't choose who he loves. Your family should understand that. Westeros and its bloody houses. Who fucking cares? They're still my family. My brothers and sisters. They had nothing to do with it. I suppose that's true. Just remember, we have a good thing here. And any moment now, we're gonna be rich. <laughs> Let's make a toast. To all of us deadly bastards. To 800 gold dragons in our pocket. Well said. Beske, I thought freed slaves put the bounty on Bazak. They did. With his own gold. So why are the fucking Lost Legion here? Oh, is that Tazal? From the Volantis job? Maybe he's forgotten about that. You! I told you if I saw you again... Tazal! Isn't it funny how life brings old friends together? Now cut your fucking throats! Tavern's closed. What are you doing here? Where is he? Where's who? Here. 400 dragons. They must be working for the Wise Masters. And that's all you're getting. Fine. We'll take it. Asha, no. Good. Now, show me the fat man. Don't do anything foolish. We're all cell swords, Tazal. We are nothing like you. The Lost Legion are the blood of all that here. And we are done taking orders from whimpering pigs. Bloody hell! And we're done with you, too. You just made a huge mistake, Tazal. You two are going to be useful to me for once. Not bloody likely. The wise masters will hear how Asha Forrester kidnapped the venerable Bezak. How he took 400 gold dragons and then killed Bezak anyway. Me? Luckily, we were there to deliver swift justice. So you steal the money and we get the blame. Ponteosinas! All right, who dies first? Who wants to dance at the end of the sword? Kill them now! No one more life. Here's one. Come on! Me. Nul mon épée. You owe me one. Oh, 
This reminds me of <laughs> that brothel in Novos. You kill me, and the lost legion won't stop. We need to go. Come on. Malcolm. Damn. We have to keep moving. Malcolm, stop. Asher, I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. What are you doing here? Your brother Ethan sent me. I'm here to bring you home. En gros, Asher serait mort. Si... <rire> en vrai, il serait mort si jamais. Euh... Ah, j'ai pas envie de Malcolm. Non, je vais esquiver en plus. Je vais merde. Je... <rire> Euh, parfois, c'est pas souvent heureusement. Regarde. Merci Nicole Martinez pour cette histoire. <rire> Merci euh, TTG Trad Team. Ah, c'est qui lui On veut. C'est Rodrick. Ah, il est pas mort Far enough. I come from the twins bearing the dead of House Forrester. Lordly types from the looks of them. All right, 
We'll take them. Well, they're not free, are they? How much are you paying for them? Sir Ryland. You again. Who have you got this time? Sir Some Ryland. poor peasant dressed up like a I, lord. Uh, a stable boy was, in Bannerman's clothes. Uh, uh, you keep this at dusk And you have the fucking stones to try it again. No, I... This house has suffered the loss of many good men. And you dare come here claiming to have fought Lee. <laughs> now, Why? I'm dumping in the river then! On the bush. You come back here again, you won't be leaving! You got that? Aye, oh, I heard you! That was a sheep fucker. I'm sorry, sir. I don't worry, sir. Seven hours. What is it, sir? This one's still alive! Who the? Who are you? It's me, Roderick. Roderick? Roderick? By the gods, it is you, sir. Fetch the maester, hurry! Fetch the maester, Roderick. The type hasn't even been looked at when we were in the woods. I'm sorry. To see my son. <laughs> Sir, my lady, I must insist that you leave. No, Roderick, what have they done to you? These wounds would have killed any other man. As it is, he may never walk again. Qu'est-ce qu'ils font? Roderick? What's moi. wrong with him? He drank the milk of the poppy. Please don't leave me. Not yet. How bad is it? <laughs> Maestor Tengren says your leg may never fully heal. And your face. I look half as bad as I feel. Well, at least you look better than you did. <laughs> Roderick, there's something you need to know. Ethan is dead. Ethan? Bruce Bolton's bastard came here and threatened to take me away. Ethan grabbed me. And that monster put a blade through his throat. Like it was nothing. Ethan? How could this happen to him? I can't believe he's gone. He's too young. Me neither. We're planning to honor Ethan in the grove, alongside father. And now mother wants me to write this song for the funeral. I can't. 
You can, Talia. I know you can. It's been chaos here since he died. We have White Hill soldiers stationed in our courtyard. Even the small folk don't feel safe. You need to show everyone who this house belongs to. They need a lot. You're still a hero to them. If you lead, others will follow. I know you still need time to heal, but... I'll be fine, Talia. The Council's meeting in the Great Hall right now, actually. Nobody expects you there, but if you think you're ready... I want to go. Can you even stand? They could use your leadership. I guess we'll see. What do they say? I missed you, brother. <laughs> you can do this, Roderick. I know you can. Je bien toi. Why'd you do that? I won't let anyone see you like this. Not when the house appears so weak already. I need to attend that meeting. And you will. But you will get there on your feet. <laughs> it's a long way to the Great Hall. We can't risk you falling where others can see. Take my hand. Let me help you. Thank you, Talia. Ready? That's it. Il va y une canne. Oh. Everyone will be so glad to see you up. Though, I think you'll find that much has changed. This is the seat of the Night's Watch. The wall. Always wanted to see it, but not like this. Recruits at the gate! Giants, doesn't it? You're new. 
Here to take the black. Have mm. you got that look about you? Aye, I am. Thought so. I'm new here myself. Frostfinger, he's the one you want. Handles all new recruits. Which one's Frostfinger? That grizzled old prune over there. Says us new recruits are all dead men. But don't let him scare you. <laughs> That's just his way. You seem nice. That's not so good round here. Like a girl, a woggling girl, maybe. Tuttle, nephew to Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of Ironrath. Garrett Tuttle of Ironrath. And how does a Castellan's nephew get himself sent to the wall? You're a thief. A raper. I killed a man who murdered my family. Then you know how to fight, at least. And you're no liar, either. Sir? From Duncan Tuttle. Castellan of House Forester. So there's a... My uncle wrote to the Night's Watch. He goes on for a bit. But then he asks us to make you a ranger. As if it's a knighthood. So you see, Tuttle, I know all about you. Maybe I just spell them. You are a killer. Okay. Even if you are man enough to own up to it. Yes, sir. Now then, we'll start your training in the morning. For today, you need a cot and a cloak. Understood. <sighs> oh, and Tuttle. Sooner or later, the Night's Watch will be your death. When it comes, try to make it quick. Merci, mec. Merci. Last we'd heard, Asher was in Slaver's Bay, so Malcolm caught a ship headed for... They give us month-old bread! Gah, there's fucking worms in it. The Lord Whitehill hears about these. We should just take what we need. I'd rather die the Whitehill soldiers always starving. seem to be angry, and we have too few men to handle them. Let's just get to the Great Hall. You know what else? No fucking wine. Well, there must be wine in the cellars. De Gaulle's locked him up tight, just like his own cunt. He has no... Is that him? Has to be, doesn't it? He's hideous. <laughs> He's, He's had a run-in with Walder Frey, did And he's you? leaning on a girl. I should have buried him with the corpses. Forest is a real first. shame about your leg, my Who lord. gives a toss? Don't let go of your sister now. What? We have business in the Great Hall. <laughs> go round. Get out of my way. I'm quite comfortable, thank you. And I don't think you're gonna make me. I wonder what's weaker. Your legs? Or this house? 
I am the lord of this house, and you will move. Go on then, my lord. Vaimas picked. Let's go. Bon bat. Avec Tali à côté, plus on joue à autre chose. It's madness. You can't starve them out. I will not coddle our enemies. So you'd rather they riot? Both of you, please. If they riot, we'll fight. That's foolishness. It doesn't matter what you think. It's my decision as sentinel. My lords. Allez, salut mon pote. Je suis vivant. Roderick. My boy. Come join us. Lady Talia, you should have told us the Lord needed help. Bien. It's good. It's good to see you awake, Lord Roderick. We didn't expect you so soon. The Maester said it would be weeks before you were walking, if you walked again at all. It was highly probable. I'm not here to talk about my elf. Perhaps we should get started. Yes, let's. Dali has told me the state of our house. Then you know our situation is grim. No thanks to your sentinel. He's riling up the Whitehill soldiers. They're our bloody enemies! You'll bring Lord Whitehill down on us, you fool! My lords, please! No, I'm a fool. At least I was there by Ethan's side when Ramsay stole. Ethan made it clear I wasn't wanted. He needed you there. Now he's dead and Ryan's a hostage. I am your lord. Of course. Apologies, my lord. The White Hills are my brother. We fight amongst ourselves, when we should be fighting them. We'd need an army to win that fight. If we don't have one. Not anymore. Then find me one, Sir Roy. That's no simple command, my lord. Most of our men fled after Lord Ethan was killed. And our allies are either dead or too afraid of the Boltons to help us. You forget the Glenmores. You'd be wed to Elena Glenmore already, if not for the war. And her father is no coward. Now that you've returned, the marriage can proceed as planned. The marriage? Well, that much has changed. The Glenmores may no longer desire the union. Lady Elena will decide for herself. Your betrothed is on her way here as we speak. Lady Elena? She's coming now! Why is she coming here? She means to pay her respects to your father. But it could also be a chance to solidify our arrangement. Thank you, Helen. If she still wishes to marry, we'd have the allies we so desperately need. Their army would become oath-bound to Roderick. And we could burn High Point to the fucking ground! <laughs> yes, this marriage could be our chance. Of course, we must hope Lady Elena still wants to marry Roderick. Talking about a marriage, not an ironwood contract. Tell me, those have a point. Not the man I used to be. You can still make her happy, Roderick. And she can do the same for you. If Elena does come to Ironrath, she'll see those soldiers in the courtyard. We starve them out, and they'll have to leave. I'd rather they be lying around drunk than setting the stables on fire. My lord, perhaps you could put an end to this tiresome dispute. Just handily. Perhaps a few meals are in order, but no wine. It's a start, at least. Now, there's nothing more to discuss. I should have explained. Maester, it's time to light the ironwood torches. Yes, my lady. Welcome back, my lord. It's got to be back. Gregor last lit these torches when his mother passed. 
Ironwood doesn't burn easily, he told me. But foresters have a way. And now we light them for him and Ethan. How is your song coming? Ethan always helps me with music. It's not the same without him. I can help you with it. That's all right. The last time you sang, all the dogs in the kennel started howling. <laughs> but thank you. Everyone knows how much Ethan meant to you. I'm sure it will honor him well. About Elena, I've sent a letter to Mira. The Tyrells hold much influence over the Glenmores. I don't know where things stand between her and Lady Marjorie, but maybe your sister can find a way to help. Super. Voilà, c'est là où je vais devoir utiliser le saut. Parce que je ne fais la faveur à. On est It's entirely ridiculous. If it's not the flowers, it's the food or the table settings. <coughs> Is that the letter to the orphanage? Yes, my lady. It's nearly done. Make sure to tell them we'll send all the leftovers. And mm, something nice after that. Lady Marjorie intends to visit again very soon. Lovely. They'll be pleased to hear that. I had to borrow that from father. Mine was stolen, can you imagine? I wonder who it was. Oh, are there any more invitations to send, or are we finally done with the cursed things? One more. An invitation to Sir Maynard. Ah, yes. One of my father's favorite drinking companions. I have a letter for Lady Mira Forrester. Thank you. My pleasure, Lady Mira. What is it, Mira? It's from my mother. She asks that I help ensure Roderick's betrothal to Elena Glenmore remain intact. How can you do that from a thousand leagues away? Ah, it's my help she's after, isn't it? She's a bold woman. Most would shy away from asking such things. Pay no mind to her. She asks too much. She's not entirely wrong. A letter from me could encourage the Glenmores to honor the betrothal. But it wouldn't be very discreet you'd be forcing their hand. That isn't the way I do things. You pushed me before, and you saw the results. I'm sure your brother can secure the marriage on his own. I'd better get going. Mira, we'll talk more later. If Lady Marjorie wrote a letter... No, no, no. I'm sorry, Roderick. No, oh, no. Sir Maynard, you are hereby invited... Mira, Lady Marjorie sent me to pick up the letters. Sir Maynard? Oh, the man's breath smells like a brew house. I was hoping I'd catch you at something slightly more exciting. A love letter, perhaps? Or a declaration of war? I know you're very busy with Lady Marjorie and... and all that's happening with your family. But I was hoping we could talk. If you don't mind. 
Go ahead then. Well, it's... We really should get these letters sent first. Do you need any help with those? I've got them. be new here, but you're in my spot. So move. Oui, tu peux l'ignorer. Carrette. Wrong fucking answer. Most of you will be dead within the year. <sighs> Frostfinger and his bloody speeches. If you want to survive in the night's watch, listen close. You know why I got sent to the wall? Wall was erected what? over 8,000 years ago. At this girl I used to fuck now and again. Face like a queen, tits like a whore. Turned out she was married to some lordly. He tried to stick me with this. I stuck it in him instead. So next time I say move, you'd best fucking move. Shut up for once, will you? What's your problem? I'm sick of Finn bragging about all the girls he's fucked. And what diacrime are you here for? Fucking potatoes. Potatoes? I got caught stealing a bag of them. You both need to stop talking. Nobody cares, thief. Don't call me that. My name's Cutter. Cutter the potato thief. There's one for the songs. Oi, my sister was hungry. I've got something for your sister. Will you stop arguing? Who in seven hells is talking back there? Top. Who was it? Thank you, my gosh. These two were arguing. <laughs> Not wise to point the finger at your new brothers, Top. <laughs> Garrett Tuttle here wants to be a ranger. So we can go north of the wall and die on some wildling spear. But what he wants doesn't mean shit. So today you're all gonna show me what you're made of. Can you swing a sword? Shoot a bow? Are you strong? Those who do well might just survive. The rest of you. Frostfinger. Oh, nice. I need a word. Go on, get started. Oh. Best of luck, Tuttle. Get on. No! C'est ça pour cet épisode, euh, les gens. Je pense que ça vous aura plu. Mais c'est un petit pouce si vous avez plaisir.